Hello and welcome to the newest episode of our Let's Explain series. Today we'll be taking a look at one of MicroE's newest projects and also we'll be having a special guest with us today, Buggy. The project uses two clicks, Light Ranger 3, a rangefinder module which uses the time of flight principle to measure the distance between two objects. Uh, it emits an infrared beam which goes to the object, gets reflected back to the sensor and the chip calculates the distance between those objects by measuring the time spent traveling from point A to point B. It is precise, reliable and it requires no contact which makes it perfect for use in industrial environments and for example robotics. The next click is RGB driver. RGB driver specializes in handling uh, LED applications which require loads of power. It has a three channel RGB driver and each of the channels has a MOSFET which enables them to handle huge voltages, sorry high voltages. The click has two terminals, a terminal which is used for an external power supply and a terminal which is used to control LED elements. That was all about the clicks and now let's explain the code. Today we'll be using MicroE's newest IDE, Neto Studio. So let's begin our journey in the main function, which has two parts, initialization and the application task. In the initialization we can see that both of the clicks are using the I2C serial interface. Here we initialize both of the micro buses on the uh, development board, number one and number five. In the application task, we can see what the project really does. It measures the distance and depending on the distance measured, it uh, lights up the LED track either to red, orange or green. And it does so every 300 milliseconds. For this demo, we'll be using this 12 voltage power supply. Let's connect it to the RGB driver. Ground goes to ground and voltage goes to voltage. Next up is the RGB LED tape. Light Ranger here will be measuring the distance between the buggy and the sensor and sending all that data to the MCU. The board is now online. Let's turn on the power supply. We shall be controlling the buggy through the buggy application. See how the LED tape changes colors as the buggy gets closer to the Light Ranger. Let's go backwards. Well, there you go. That was our little demo. That's all we have for you today. I hope it was both fun and helpful. Uh, as always, you can find the links in the description below. Until the next time, bye!